and greetings everybody. This is Jester welcoming you to another review of some ground equipment. And today we're going to be reviewing the Solony Paladin Environmental Suit. I couldn't get it out there, could I? Anyway, Solony Paladin Environmental Suit. Now then. This is a rather odd piece of kit in the way that you can buy it. It's not part of a set. You pick the suit up for 50 low buy. But I'll just explain to you how it's done. So, if you go to the lobby store you go to ground equipment and scroll down there it is Solony Paladin environmental suit mark 12 we'll go through all the stats in a moment but this is the complicated bit not only do you have to pay 50 low buy for it you also have to get three other environmental suits where do you get those from? Well, I'll just show you one of the environmental suits first of all. This is one of them, the Solony Marksman environmental suit. And there's three different types of suit that you have to get with your three with your 50 low buy to pick up this suit. So, let's go back to the lobby store. So the first one is the Solony Enforcement Enforcer Environmental Suit. The next one is the Solony of oh, oh hang on, what we got here? Solony Enforcer. Ah, oh, there we are. Solony Marksman and Solony Striker. So you need to get those three, as well as your 50 low buy. To buy this. So where on earth do you get them from? Well you have to go into a story arc and the story arc is a step between stars. So what I did was you start this story arc and you get to a point in the story arc, you'll, you'll see it, where you have to acquire an environmental suit to cross a gap in the station. What's happened is in the story arc, without spoiling it too much for you, there's an explosion and there's a gap between one part of the space station and another and you have to move through the gap, through the space, to get to the other side and perform various tasks. But anyway. Before you get to that, you have to get the environmental suit, and that's one of those suits. Now then, once you get to that point, what you need to do at that stage is pick up the suit and then quit it. Now, what you used to be able to do is go back in, play the game again, do exactly the same, and you get a second suit and do the do the, and do exactly the same again for the third suit however i think cryptic did a bit of a patch and i noticed that you couldn't do it all in one day so i did it over three days for the other solony suit and what do i mean by the other one well you not only get a white one you can also get a black one This is the black one. This is the black version. Exactly the same, except it's in black. Now then, what does this what does this suit give us? We'll go back to the white one. because uh, I'm quite fond of the white one. It was the very first one I ever got. Um, what does this suit give us? Well, 
it's not part of a set, so you can you can put it on its own. But not being part of a set means that it's not as good as the other sets that that you can pick up with the other environmental. But it's an environmental suit. So unlike the Nukara one, which we tested the other day, this won't be as strong. But it is agile. So we've got 34.9 physical and kinetic damage, 5% energy damage, 34.9 energy damage resistance rating, 8.7 anti-proton damage resistance rating, 69.8 radiation damage resistance rating, 69.8 fire damage resistance rating, 8.7 proton damage uh, resistance rating, 2.5 critical chance, 20% critical severity, 43.6 root hold root resistance rating and hold resistance rating, 43.6 knockback resistance rating and 10% physical damage. Now this is Mark 12. Now if you want to uprate it, you go to upgrade and you select your ground gear tech upgrade and you apply it. And I'll keep applying it. So there we go. Do it again. You can see that. So as you can see, it costs more and more to upgrade it. So we're now at 13 or 14, sorry. There we go. So I'm going to keep it at that for now. So I've upgraded the suit. Oh, need to need to equip it, don't I? So I've upgraded the suit and I'm going to be using it with my Mako shield. I'm going to be using it with the Lucari piezoelectric wrist apparatus. And I'm, my secondary weapon is going to be my temporal defense, chronotagon height. I'm going to have to change these teeth, it's no good. Temporal defense, chronoton high density beam rifle. Um, I'm going in with my Herald Engineering Kit, my Universal Kit Module Ravager, Cloaked Mine Barrier, Molten Terran, Scarab Plating and Coronton Mine Barrier. I've got a third place here for something else. So let's have a look see what we can fit in there, see if there's anything out of any. We'll, we'll put a small hypo in there to give us uh, some life if we need it. So, there you have it. I hope I've been able to explain that. So what we're going to do now is we're going to go down to Nukara Prime and we're going to knock a few Tholians about. And if we can, we'll try and do a little bit of sword play as well, although that didn't go down well the last time I tried it with my uh, Nukara suit, which I, uh, which I reviewed a few days ago. Right, without further ado, I'll beam down and I'll see you down there. And here we are on Lucara Prime. And one thing I am going to do is just introduce you again to the endeavours. If you're not doing these, then you should do, because it does help with your ship builds and also your ground. Um, weapons and uh, builds. So, in this one we have to defeat Tholians 10. I'm going to do that with the weapons that we have here. Now, what I also will do is, um, as you know, for those who follow me on a regular basis, I do like a bit of sword play. So we, well, we don't need that. So what we will do, we'll do a bit of sword play first of all let's go to the front lines and have a few uh, sessions with those pesky Tholians okay so here we are and let's get into it we didn't do so we didn't do too well last time I was here I hope to do better this time so straight away we've dispatched one. Oh, here's, here's 
There's some here, look. Swap weapons. Damage yes, I must admit, it is my favourite weapon. So, we, as you can see here on the right, we have actually hit our personal endeavours. So, what I want to try and do when we get a moment, I shall just hide out of the way. And I'll just change the weapons around a little bit. There we go. Right, let's see if we can do a bit of sword play. Because as you know, I'm quite partial to a little bit of uh, sword play. Right, so let's find these Tholians. Okay, let's change. Let's have a look. Marvellous. Now you want to find them, you can't find them anywhere. Right, here we go. No. Oh. I'm struggling to find them now. They're normally all over the place. Ah, there's one. Let's give him the good news. Okay, let's let's not give him the good news. difficult to battle of these. I may have been a little bit too harsh with the with my last review with the uh, because even with this suit which is quite agile and nimble we're still struggling to, to fight them with a sword. But we will give it a go. here as well. Oh, where are they? Oh. How dare he hit me from behind. Hit me from behind would have some of like that. Yeah, you can't seem to get more than one manoeuvring on this one. Oh, we nearly had him then. Oh, if that would have connected, he would have been out with one stroke. Ah, there's another one. I'm just going to be the lucky chap to get the full effects of my eye. Oh, my sword, but anyway. There we go. I do like this sword, it's like some sort of lightsaber. It's just a strange, it's just unfortunate that we can't get a full... Right, let's see if we can... See, the, as soon as they... As I see you coming there, they, they run. They're quite little nimble critters of these, aren't they? Right, well, we won't spend too much time here. Oh! Well, that was a shame, wasn't it? We were I did a little bit too much thinking, well, this would have been to suffer the consequences of me dying now, so we'll make this the last one. So if he'll stand still and let me hit him. Well, just stand still, will you? Right, where? My word. It moves well for sit. Mind you, he has got more legs than me.
He's not going to stand still, is he? Stay away. Oh, word. This is not easy fighting Tholians with a sword. Point to, point to, not, to know. Don't fight Tholians with a sword. It's virtually impossible. Right, then we dispatched him. So I'm going to quit while I'm ahead. And head off back to the camp. This is not back at the camp, is it? I've gone to the wrong camp. What a buffoon. Right, here we go. We'll go to the right camp this time. Right, here we are. We have arrived, finally. What a performance that was. So, this is the Solony Paladin environmental suit. I hope you understand how to acquire it. It is a very complicated means of acquiring an environmental suit, but it is well worth it because I do think it looks the part. I do like this. I like the black one as well, but this is my favourite. It has a nice little light on, um, and you can use it when, when you go mine dilithium. Excellent. Very pleased with it. Um, I've had it for some time. I would highly recommend it. So, if you've uh, enjoyed this review, or you'd like to know anything uh, else about how to acquire this suit, please drop me a line. I'll be happy to try and help as much as I possibly can. And please like and tune in for further reviews. So, until next time, this is Jester signing off.